things to do if you are visiting Sydney in 2022. Spoke. So the first spot is the Bondi Asberg Pool. It's a 50 meters salt water pool in Bondi Beach. This is the landmark of Bondi Beach for the last 100 years. This is the most Instagrammed place that you can possibly see. You have to visit it. And what I love about this, because I, sometimes I like to go and swim in a salt water next to the sea is every Friday Saturday there is a live music after 4 or 5 p.m. and you can swim while you listen to live music. Things to do in Sydney 2022 numero due is you need to catch the manly ferries. I love catching the ferry from a Darling Harbour up all the way to Manly and what I love about the ferry is like a touristic tour. For $10 you actually see, you go through, see the bridge, Sydney Opera House, you see all these beautiful houses, all the beach side, you see all the different beaches on the way to Manly, and you see all is fantastic, you have to see that. I used to work in Manly uh, and I used to go to work there every day and I used to catch a ferry every day and I've never got tired. Every day was like a beautiful view, every day you start your day better. You have to see that. Things to do in Sydney 2022 numero 3 is the Toronga Zoo. Toronga Zoo has more than 2,000 different animals. And when I went the first time, I was like, oh, it's just a zoo. But it's actually shockingly amazing the view and the different animals they have. From the koala up to the giraffe, elephant, lion, tigers is amazing. And it's this huge. It's like, it's like it's like a jungle. Feels like you are in Africa or something. It's amazing. The they create this fantastic natural habitat for the animals. It's huge. It's like in the forest, and you can actually see from distance Sydney Hopper House at the bridge. Like the view, the fresh air, the animals. Is is I was shocked. I was impressed. Amazing. Things to do in Sydney numero quattro is the fish market. The fish market in Sydney is the second biggest and most diverse fish market in the world after Tokyo. It's huge and they have a like they have a one I think I was reading somewhere 1000 different supply all around the Asia Pacific and I think they have a 100 different type of fish every day. It's open every day, 7 days. I was, I was impressed. So much different type of fish from all around Asia Pacific, fresh, every day. Fishermen that wake up at 2, 3 a.m. and pick up the fish before 6 a.m. is, I was, wow. One of the best fish in the world, 100 different varieties, amazing. Things to do in Sydney, 2022, numero cinque is the Opera Bar. I'm sure you've heard about the Sydney Opera House in the bridge. Okay, in that spot, there is a beautiful place which is called Opera Bar. It's amazing. So just a part of the beautiful cocktail they make, it's a little bit expensive, be ready for it. And the beautiful food, the restaurant you can bring there. I love the Sunday session because they have a live music and you can have a drink while you look at the Opera Bar and the bridge. It's amazing, it's so relaxing, and just the view while you see beautiful cocktail is the most coolest, trendy spot in Sydney. I hope that helps. Push the like button, subscribe. I'll see you next time.